child. Little Ganesha was a very playful child. He would easily get attracted to small things. One day, Lord Vishnu had come to visit Lord Shiva. While the two were deep in conversation, Lord Ganesha saw Vishnu's lethal weapon, the chakra, lying near him. He picked it up and started playing and rotating it like a pinwheel. Vishnu was so engrossed in his conversation that he did not pay attention to Ganesha's antics. I love this chakra. Why don't I eat it? thought Ganesha and popped it into his mouth. Soon, it was time for Lord Vishnu to leave. He looked for his chakra, but it was nowhere to be found. Where could it be? wondered Vishnu and then realized with his divine sight that Ganesha had swallowed it. How do I take it out from his stomach without hurting him? He thought. If I ask him to give it back, he might not return it. However, if I have to get it back by force, he is very powerful and it might turn into an ugly battle. Then an idea struck him. He decided to make Ganesha laugh. The plan was to make him laugh so much and so hard that the chakra would come out of his stomach on its own. Ganesha was known for his hearty laugh where his entire body would shake. Vishnu made his way to Ganesha's chamber. Look at me, Ganesha, he said. Then he caught hold of his ears with both his hands and acted as though he was sitting down with his knees bent. But before Ganesha could realize what he was doing, he got up again. Vishnu went on performing such strange antics till Ganesha started laughing heartily. Slowly and slowly, Vishnu had made him laugh so much that he spat out the chakra while laughing. Vishnu was relieved while Ganesha was more than happy with what he had seen. From then on, all the people visiting Ganesha's temples performed these actions in front of the Lord to seek his forgiveness and blessings. Music